How about we have some pretty exciting shows coming because that is let's let's be honest that's that's the best part about it is the theater. That's true. Uh, we do. In fact, this weekend we have the Jimi Hendrix Experience, which only has about 300 tickets left. Wow. Uh, probably considered the guitar event of the of the year, so people should come see that definitely. But the two that I'm most excited about, um, we have Disney's Fantasia mm -hmm. coming, which is uh, the film, the original film. That really put Disney on the map. Both the 1940s film and the 2000 film will be shown with the Czech National Orchestra playing the score from each on stage. So um, live as the movies going live on. Oh, as man. the music's going on. So we have our big screen and that that'll be part of um, uh, what people will be able to see as they hear the music live from the orchestra. It's cool because it'll give kids who see the Mickey Mouse Clubhouse every day an appreciation for where Mickey came from. The other thing that I think is cool is the, the ballet that I've seen tons of advertising about. We have coming the um, New York City Ballet, which arguably is the best classical ballet company in the United States. Wow. So to have that company come to Charleston is a real coup for us. And they'll be presenting four different programs, um, choreography, everything from um, Peter Martins, who's the executive um, director and artistic director of the ballet, to um, music by P, um, Philip Glass, uh, <clears throat> etc. So it's really going to be probably the best night of classical dance one could imagine seeing. And here listen, in those companies all talk. So once word gets out, you're going to have to be turning them away. Absolutely. Tom, appreciate you coming yeah, in. And you nice can always to go to the here. box office in person or you can go online or if you, you can want go tickets online. to either one of those events. Anyway. More to come here on News 2 Midday.